Kia ora, good morning on this beautiful Father's Day. Hi guys. We're out here at Waiatapu, which means the sacred water, and it's beautiful. If you can see, that is not, um, that is not mist from the frost or evaporation, that is geothermal steam. So it's just beautifully hot like a spa. Best way to spend it in nature to wake up this morning. Yeah, that's definitely true. Uh, we thought we'd make a quick video just to uh, give a lot of love to dads out there being Father's Day. You know, um, dads do an awesome job in our uh, society and we all have a dad. And um, I would like to pay uh, honour to my dad today. My dad died uh, nearly four years ago and me and him grew up. We had a bit of an up and down relationship at times. But uh, he got sick and then it was a chance for me to uh, make amends and apologize for uh, the things I'd done wrong to him and to show appreciation to him. So I helped him when he passed over. I helped him, told him about my near-death experience and I gave him a lot of love and then I uh, apologized to him. And it was actually beautiful. So I'm really grateful for that. And uh, I'd like to uh, give my dad a lot of love today in the spirit world. I know he pops in and sees me all the time and uh, he taught me a lot about how to be a good man and how to be a good dad and he taught me uh, a lot of hard lessons that I had to put into practice in my own life and I never gave up on my kids. I did what I had to do to get custody of my kids and be the best dad I could do and I overcame a lot of hardships and today, uh, you know, I'm very grateful I never quit and it's because of my dad. You know? mm. So happy Father's Day, Terry, there in the spirit world. Mm. And happy Father's Day to my dad mm. over there in Bendigo, Australia. Yeah. I miss you very much, and I'm looking forward to seeing you when you come over for Azrael and Josh's wedding. It's going to be amazing to give you that big hug that I can't give you today. Mm. Um, I appreciate I appreciate everything that you bring into my life and all of the love that I feel from you and it doesn't matter the distance or or anything um, it matters what's in here mm. yeah. I love you dad mm. yeah. beautiful and like we like to uh, give a lot of love and uh, to all the solo mums out there that did the, the, the dad's job and uh, we honor you guys today too because uh, we know how hard it is to do that so uh, you know you're in our mind and our hearts as well you know because yeah. uh, big ups yeah definitely I'm one of them mm. <laughs> yep definitely uh, both Tony and I as, as he said we've both done mm. the single parent jobs yeah. we've both come together um, now as a good family unit but separately we have experience of being both the mother and the father for our children yeah. and all the sacrifices we understand all the sacrifices that have to be made in that position to be a really good strong parent and do the best for your children yeah, yeah that's definitely true like uh, twice I had to go to court and get custody of my son my uh, sons and my daughter and uh, mm. when I got custody of my sons, my, at the, my lawyer didn't turn up, so I had to represent myself. And um, I knew I had to do what I had to do. And uh, I did it, you know. Uh, I had to overcome a lot. And because uh, I didn't want my kids growing up with all my problems and uh, thinking that I gave up on them, you know. And so I, I didn't, you know. I did what I had to do to get sort myself out and to be the best dad I could you know and uh, I made a lot of mistakes as all dads do but I'd always look for better ways to doing it better you know and I'd always just do my I always did my best okay. and uh, you know today I'm like super grateful you know so just giving a lot of love out there for all the dads for uh, doing what we do it's not easy being a man you know we have to deal with so much and we have to deal with society's expectations on us you know mm -hmm. and we have to deal with our, our own insecurities and our own problems and all that you know so 
lot of love to all your dads out there, you know, all you fellow men, you know, never give up, mate, never give up, guys, you know, I used to be homeless, I had nothing, and then I pulled myself together, and I got custody of my kids, and I've got a beautiful life now, you know. Look where we are, look yeah. what we're doing. You know, if I can do it, anybody can do it. Yeah. Mm. And a lot of love to you on this day, Tony. Thank you. Because I know and I see the power of where you've been, where you've come from, all the sacrifices that you've made, not just for your children, but for yourself, because it's really important that first we look after our own mental health and ourselves. Yeah. That's where the self-love comes in. Mm. And you've given that to yourself by your actions and your strength standing up mm. okay. and Thank being you. who you are in the world and showing up now to show everyone else yeah. who you are in yeah. the world. Yeah. Thank you I for love that. you. Yeah, I love you too. And I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Thank you for that. Mm. Sort of heart sharing. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm quite, I, I, it's a hard one for me to take praise like that because uh, I grew up with a lot of, uh, I used to get bullied and hassled and criticised and uh, told that I was a loser and I was ugly and I was uh, fat and no good. And so I have to deal with all that stuff and um, it's a part of the inner work. And, um, you know, I'm learning to love myself because Karen's showing me good ways to change and I, I do my best to be my own best friend and to love who I am you know and I've been through a lot of dark times and today my life is mostly light mm. and our best is all we can ever ask of yeah. ourselves yeah. I had a down day yesterday yeah. I was real close to tears they were just right there but I let them out and yeah. I sat with them and I allowed it and I understand that some days you just get shit like that. It happens, but all we can ever do is our best, and that's all we can ever ask of ourselves, and it's all we can ever ask of each other. So get out there and just do your best. That's all you yeah. need to do. Yeah. So so have a have a beautiful day today, guys. Uh, just take life as it comes, and just mm -hmm. appreciate no matter what's happening in your life. There's always something to be grateful. For. You know, lots of love from us, and uh, we're always here if someone wants to message us for uh, any, anything to talk anything. about. Anything. Out of Hanoi, beautiful yeah. people. Yeah. Lots of love today and every day. Okay. See ya. Bye.